hi viewers so today uh, topics uh, we seeing with um, uh, c sharp uh, so actually uh, i've uh, faced even a lot of developer will face in a generic uh, type of list they can't go and copy uh, from one type uh, uh, to the another type of list so example i have a list here list one so this is the type of uh, uh, class uh, lad so uh, see the same property which have the final item but i can't uh, uh, make it uh, works by copying uh, this list to that so uh, how to achieve this so there is a lot of uh, option you can go and use the for each loop and uh, just copy pairs uh, one, one item to that but it's really a tough job you if you have uh, some 10 items it's fine but if you have a uh, lakhs of items so how long it will take a system to copy paste uh, from the one list to here and there so link you have a good option to copy in a runtime with a uh, uh, you can copy to any type so that is what all about a uh, link you use now so we'll uh, see about lot of uh, developers really not know about that so before that i will show you what the exactly the issue we are facing see i have a list two i just want to pause the list one because i thought it's have the same property but it's really not i am getting a error what it is uh, cannot implicitly convert the type from the system collection general list lad2 console app uh, to final items so that is what the issue here so how to achieve this by using convert all method yeah is there a something name called convert all by using that okay so uh, here what uh, the parameter it asking uh, as uh, this is the output uh, so you need to create on a new type here by I just go and uh, initiate that okay. okay x such that here I going to tell that uh, I going to initiate uh, with the new items so what I it's going to do the list one convert all the data uh, to the final items so then here I just want to pause my first name uh, to x dot first name and last name to x dot last name then finally data birth to x dot data birth So this will uh, make you very easy and comfort. Okay, list two. and it's very fast. Okay, uh, with the convert all, it will uh, convert whatever the uh, data you have in the list one or uh, in a one shot it will convert. Uh, if you do the for each, so how the things will work? Like where item in list one then blah 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 you have to write and you have to go and uh, initiate this final item uh, as like this item equal to new item and then in the item you have to pass data birth means item dot data birth and then finally list dot add you need to go and pass this item so that is what you are doing for this for loop it will uh, loop uh, like every items and it will insert so instead of for this only we are writing the code like this it will convert totally all if you have one lakh record in a second it won't take any delay to copy the value 
okay so that is what uh, it's going so let's keep the breakpoint we'll see in a runtime how these things are working okay let's go by a step over so it's created my list instance and the item it's building okay so it's doing first time for each loop and it's checking no data then that's it let's go and add in the next slide one more time so this is what comes output okay we can't directly write the console app so just to remove that so I'll add some data go free learns okay so again I'm running the application so you feel that uh, speed that actually it's pausing out so on the loop it's adding there is no it so that's it that's it how this uh, speed see in a loop it has to loop uh, every items but in convert all directly it's got convert so that is what all about the convert list is doing <coughs> good uh, uh, we got the way okay uh, s sorry I didn't mention how to add um, this I item finally okay no issues I think uh, in a break man you saw the data I guess I hope uh, it's uh, really uh, helpful for you uh, to go ahead and uh, do the items see this uh, if you do this will be not that much effective if you go like that so that's what I recommend you guys to learn the link you lot uh, to achieve a lot of scenarios in a good easier fashion this will help MEC application in a next level Thanks for watching the video guys. If you like my video, please like it and subscribe for getting more updates.